The relationship between manufacturing process planning and manufacturing quality planning is built into Eris Innovator. When adding a new step to the process plan, like this one here, where we've added Operation 5, Prepare Parts for Shipping, we can see the new step represented in the corresponding process quality document. Let's take a look to better understand the relationship between the two. To find the related process quality document, we use the where used action on this process plan. The relationship between the manufacturing process plan and the process quality document is represented right here. So we'll navigate that relationship, we'll open up the related process quality document, and we'll be able to see the connection as soon as we open it up. So right here in red, we can see that the new step we just added, 05, prepare parts for shipping, has not yet been considered by the process quality team. So it's a new addition for them and they have an action to take. Let's look around at the process quality document and see what's in here. This document offers three ways to author and view process quality for an organization. A process control plan, a process flow diagram, and a process FMEA, which stands for failure modes and effects analysis. The process control plan begins with a description of the process itself how the process is to be measured, its specifications, and the sample frequency. Other views include the process flow diagram, demonstrating the flow and details of each step in a tree format. And finally, the process failure modes and effects analysis. The process FMEA works similar to the design FMEA in ARIS Innovator. Quality teams have a place right here to record all of the possible failure modes against a process, even operation by operation, just as they're recorded in the manufacturing process plan. For example, if this cover is assembled too tightly, it could result in cracking. So there's a spot in the FMEA to include controls that will mitigate this failure, along with actions, tools, everything they need to avoid these quality issues. All three of these views are connected, so a change in one view is reflected in the other two to keep them all in sync. Plus, all three are connected to the manufacturing process plan. You can see that connection here. Wherever there's a blue indicator, it shows you that the two are synced up. So let's see how we can edit this. Here, we'll choose to accept the change or not. Let's accept it in this case, and we'll see the red text resolve itself. It resolves itself across every view. So you can see that a change made in one view is updated in the others. The connections between the manufacturing process plan and the process quality document take place on a field by field basis. So each of the tools, operations, and steps included in the manufacturing process plan are all linked field by field to the corresponding field in the quality document. When one of these individual fields goes out of sync, you'll have a chance to refresh the information, keeping it current with the manufacturing process information. You'll have a chance to overwrite the manufacturing process information and keep the quality data, or you'll have a chance to overwrite the MPP content with content from quality. Offering these options is all under the control of your administrator. So for additional levels of quality control, you decide how you want folks to be able to change and synchronize these fields. What you're seeing here in Eris Innovator is standard functionality, connecting manufacturing process planning and manufacturing quality processes.